Namaskaram. Today we will speak about breath control. So why breath is important or why we are having this conversation right now, why we are watching this. For yoga, for actually life, breath is the main thing that keeps you alive. Breath is the main thing that keeps you going and to have chances that you have right now. With one breath you are here, with one breath you will be gone and you don't even know when it's going to be. But why we are speaking about this? Of course, we know it's very important. I have noticed before and I'm still seeing it in my old clients, how they have difficulty to inhale and exhale during practice. And also when we are in Shavasana, I notice how they are shortly inhaling and shortly exhaling, like they have some urge to finish this. This is happening because of the way of living. This is happening because of the stress level. Why this stress affects the breath this, this much? Actually, they are completely connected. When your stress level is high, generally in your life, you breathe so short, so inefficient, so fast. When you have peace in your life, when you have a little bit of stability, or at least you know how to maintain this life in your very own way, when someone guides you, you breathe slower, deeper. Not only for health, but when you breathe slower, you have more opportunity, more chances to see things clearly, right? You can give finally attention what's really happening around you or what's really happening within you, which is our subject in yoga. So today I will show you one very important breathing technique, which work like in everyone that I tried, that I witnessed. Even you have very short breathing, this will help you for sure. 424 breathing technique. What's important in this breathing technique that we will use our belly efficiently, which means every inhale we will have a big belly, the diaphragm. Every exhale we will try to take the navel in, belly in. We can even squeeze the tailbone. We call it bandha if you are familiar or not. Simply focus on expanding to the side with inhale, with exhale, taking everything in. So in this moment, close your eyes. Inhale, four, three, two, one. Hold your breath here. Stay breathless. Exhale, four, three, two, one. If you didn't wait and hold your breath, exhalation will happen unconsciously, like how it's happening in your daily life, right? But if you manage to hold your breath for one, two, three seconds, your exhalation will be conscious and you will try to exhale or start to exhale slower, deeper, longer. How long this exhale? The inhalation will be in the same quality. Even you inhale fast, you will have opportunity to take a big, deep inhale. With, with this inhale, you have chance to hold your breath. This holding will lead you to long, effortless, smooth exhale. Try it and let me know if you have any question. Everything starts with the breath, everything ends with the breath, no matter what you practice, even when you are walking. Keep it in the mind. Your life will change completely. Your very own body will change completely. Because when you breathe slower, also your organs will, will work slower, right? You will notice from the heart rate anyway. Stress is not real. Anxiety is not real. You are coming up with these things because you don't know how to maintain this living being. Start with the breath. Thank me later. Namaste.